That covered up pretty good. Play clock at two. Second down and ten. Blitz coming late. And now Swatler. The ball came out of his hand. That was Kyes and hit him. This will be reviewed right now. It's a touchdown for Houston. Patrell Jamerson on the return. And there are two pieces to this. And Mike Pereira will weigh in. The arm was going forward, but the pass might have been going backward. We'll take another look. Yeah, I would think that's incomplete. What do you think, Mike? It's, he's trying to hold it. The yeah, pass this is going back. This right? is a tough one because the first thing that you've got to look at is, is the arm going forward? And if it is going forward and defensive contact causes the ball to go backwards, then it's still considered a forward Rude pass. Rudolph's of a fumble recovered by the defense for a touchdown is under review. So they review it. It's a scoring play. And this is going to be really interesting. And what they call it. That was Kais who delivered the hit. And Trump Jamerson on the return. Well, the thing about it is Kais, he comes on the blitz. And Osweiler, he reacted like he never knew he was coming until the very last second. Now he's looking down the field and then he's trying to get it out. So say that again, Mike. I mean, we, we talk all the time. Is the arm going forward? Yes. So the arm's going forward, but to me, and we just touched on this, so just say it again, the ball looks like it's traveling backward. It but that doesn't matter. No question that it's, tra that it's traveling backwards. They've got to make two decisions here. Is he trying to bring it back toward his own body, which in fact makes it like the what was the old tuck play now is a fumble um, because that rule did change. And then the second thing is, is if the arm had started forward and defensive contact knocks it loose and causes it to go backwards, then you still have what's considered a forward pass. This is one of the more complicated plays I've seen so far um, this season. It, it, it looks to me, Mike, tell me what you think. It, it looked to me like Osweiler was trying to was trying to bring it back in, and rather than rather than let it go, he was actually trying to hold on to the ball, much like the tuck rule. Yeah, and, and, and that's the whole thing. You remember the tuck rule changed to say that if the ball comes loose, even if you're trying to bring it back, when the arm is going forward, then it, it is considered an incomplete pass. If you're bringing it down, then it's still a fumble. I, I kind of look at this, and, and really if I'm looking at the play and all the intangibles that you have, not so sure that they can change it. And we'll hear now coming up from Sean Smith. saying is there's the difference between trying to bring the ball back into your body which I think both of you feel like Osweiler was doing if that's the case and that would be a fumble that would be but again completely disregard here the act of the ball going backwards because the arm started forward and if they felt that he wasn't bringing the ball down which is what they ended up concluding then it does become an incomplete pass when the ball comes loose. That is about as convoluted a rule, a ruling as you can get. Third down and 10 from the 45. 